Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing great. In this short R tutorial, I want to show you how you can create or import a data frame in R. The first one is to create a data frame from scratch. For that, we can just first create an empty frame. We can do that with data.frame. And then afterwards, we can just add columns with different data types. As you can see here, we use the name of the data frame and then the name of the column. And then here within C, we specify the elements within the column. And here you just need to make sure that each column has the same number of rows. And then when we look at the F1, we actually see here all these four columns with our specified data. Then we have another option to create a data frame by importing a CSV file. For that, I just use the read.csv function and I already have a CSV file in my working directory. Here we also need to specify which separation we have in the file. If we don't specify the separation, R isn't able to separate the columns and because we have here a semicolon between columns, we use a semicolon as the separation. When we now look at the data frame, we see we imported the data correctly, so we have all these five columns. The third option to use a data frame is just to use a pre-installed data frame from the datasets package. For that you need to load the dataset package with library and then you can just have a look at all the available dataset and here you have different datasets and as you can see we have quite a lot. In my case I just look at the cars dataset which include speed and stopping distance of different cars and then I just specify the cars as our data frame. And when we look at that, we have the speed and the stopping distance of different cars. I hope you also have now a data set to play around in R. If this video helped, please leave a like and subscribe. Thanks a lot and see you next time.